with us. I can't. I have to study. If you change your mind, we'll be at the bar. I've ever had ends in disaster. What we got here is a failure to communicate. We're done. But, but Kelly, no! I gave up on relationships. I'm sure you're just being too hard on yourself. I'm not like those other guys. Now how about that? You see it already. Bad relationship number 252. Two. The beginning of a beautifully bad relationship. freshman year. I'm pretty sure one Friday night isn't gonna ruin your GPA. Come on, come out, have some fun. Meet a guy, take him home. Come on, Kel, we're in college. Being in college doesn't give me permission to do whatever I want. I came here to study so I can get good grades, so I can get a job. Besides, you know I'm bad with relationships. You're the one that's good with all that. You are good with guys. You get the hookups. You're perfect, aside from your utter lack of cleanliness. I'm not perfect, Kel. Besides, you can have it all too. Come out with us. Besides, I have a friend that I think you really hit it off with. I can't. Fine, Kel. Suit yourself. If you change your mind, we'll be at the bar. What the hell?
came out. I can't wait to tell Sean you're here. He'll be so excited. Oh, wait, who? Oh, Sean, the friend I was telling you about. Come on. Lauren, I'm just here to have a drink. I'll not do anything crazy. No. Come on. Lauren, no. Fine. When you're done pouting, we'll be able to get Usually a Yeah, but it didn't work out. Yeah. I mean, I like this one. Yeah, I think they're really cool. They're, uh, <coughs> Can I help you? Yes. A uh, glass of whiskey. ID. I don't think that's a good idea. Why not? Because I'm bad luck. You don't look like bad luck. Oh, but I am. Every relationship I've ever had ends in disaster. I just want to buy you a drink. And what, after that? No one ever just buys anyone a drink anymore. So what, you buy me a drink and then you take me home. In the morning I make breakfast. We drink coffee and talk about life. And then you take me home, and at my door we exchange numbers, you kiss me goodbye, and it starts all over again. No, it's just not a good idea. Actually, that sounds really nice. No, I've never had a relationship start like that that ends well. I'm sure you're just being too hard on yourself. They couldn't have been that bad. They were. I am the perfect example of how not to have a successful relationship. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to buy you a drink. And then you're going to tell me about all your so-called bad relationships. And I'll prove to you that they weren't that bad. Start from the beginning. Eric, you don't want to hear about Eric. Go on, try me. Eric was, how shall I put it, culture. It doesn't seem too bad. Oh, but it was. Why do I have to be snakes? You've seen this a few times, I take it? You ain't heard nothing yet. What? Elementary, my dear Watson. Forget it, Jake. It's Chinatown. Eric, could you not- Shirley, you can't be serious. I am serious, and don't call me Shirley. Are you talking to me? Eric, can you speak in anything other than movie quotes? You've been at this for weeks, and it's really getting on my nerves. What we got here? Failure to communicate. Maybe you'll understand this then. A relationship is like a shark. It has to constantly move forward or it dies. And I think what we have on our hands is a dead shark. Come back. Come back. I'll never let you go, Jack. Hasta la vista, baby. <laughs> you really said hasta la vista, baby, as you stormed out? Yeah, I did. All right, that wasn't too bad. What about the one after that? Bobby? Oh god, no. He couldn't have been any worse than Evan. Eric. Whatever. So what was so awful about this Bobby guy? Bobby wasn't so bad. At first. But after a while, it was apparent that he was very in touch with his emotions. Oh? Yeah. Everything okay, babe? Bobby, we need to talk. Wh what? Bobby, don't. Don't what? I'm not doing anything. You're the one who's gonna break up with me. Stop crying. You're going to make a scene. A scene? I'm not the one making a scene. You're the one making a scene. Can we do this somewhere else? Why? Why should we bother? Here's just as good as any other place to break up with me. Oh, I'm not breaking up with you. Stop crying. You're acting like a child. What? I can't do this anymore. You've done this one too many times. I can't take it anymore. 
No, no, Kelly, please don't. I'm done. Now I'm breaking up with you. But, but, Kelly, no. Please, no, I love you. Bye, Bobby. Kelly, no. Oh, Mom! I'm sorry, I didn't quite get that. Please try again. Call... Mom! I'm sorry, I didn't quite get that. Please try again. Call Mom! Calling Tom. <laughs> no way! He, he cried? Still not that bad. You know my brother once dated a dancer. Whose, whose feet stung so bad that one day they got an insect infestation, they didn't even have to call an exterminator. They just put out a pair of her rehearsal socks, and when they came back the next weekend, all the insects and the plants were dead. Still not that bad. Not that bad? Have you ever had a hysterical ex crying and clinging to your legs? Well... No. Then you have no idea. If that's the extent of your bad relationships, it's really not that bad. Oh, you haven't heard anything yet. There's more? Sam. <laughs> and Sam? Sam was the last relationship, and by far the worst. The worst? What, what could have possibly been that bad? Sam was very committed to our relationship. Isn't that what girls are always wanting? Someone committed? Training order against him. It was bad. So you're telling me you've never had a good relationship? Like, ever? Well, I did have a crush on this really cute boy in school. Steve Purcell. See? Tell me about Steve Purcell. I have only good memories of him. Of course, that could be because nothing ever happened. Pushover. I'm not like those other guys. I'm not a cry. A 
obsessive. If I wasn't serious about this, I wouldn't have stayed and listened to your relationship BS. I can see it already. Bad relationship number 252. I have never had a bad relationship. Really? They've all been happy and nice? Sure. How about that drink? Well, maybe I can't have a drink. Where are my manners? I've been talking to you all this time and I don't even know your name. I'm Kelly. Sean. Nice to meet you. Well, you already know a lot about me. So tell me something about you, Sean. I am a certified illusionist. My specialty is sleight of hand and close. Magic. <laughs> <laughs> Consider it a gift. From who? You? Yeah, me. I, uh, I was kind of hoping to be bad relationship number 253. Oh, I heard all that. I did. You know, you're beautiful, right? <laughs> to the beginning of a beautifully bad relationship. Ready. He's texting his other girlfriend, so you know, <laughs> no wonder I break up with him. <laughs> oh, I'm <fine>. <laughs> <laughs> it needs to be quiet on the set because I'm rolling and we're actually doing dialogues ish. The light just went out. I'm really confused. Oh, okay. There it is. Okay, it's back. <laughs> it All came right. back. <laughs> Whenever you're ready. Damn it! Nose, it would look kind of like yours. <laughs> <laughs> he bought you a drink. This is why. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> my therapist, he told me, don't get a nose job. You can't afford it. But I was like, oh, it's totally like a pig nose. <laughs> Why does that one break up with no. me? No. 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 <laughs> You ain't seen nothing yet. What? Kelly, I <laughs> am your father. Ah. <laughs> Rolling. Okay, so um, where, where are you from? This building. <laughs> wow, you live in my, my bar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm in the upstairs apartment. You know. Oh, okay. Drag me down. That's, that's weird. I haven't actually <laughs> met you before. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> no, so my roommate's a <laughs> made, me come down, made me come down here to try to meet men and drink. Oh, <laughs> uh, I understand. Yeah. Well, you've met a man, I'm a man. <laughs> well, yeah. Only in three countries, though. I'm extremely dense. You look like you're new and shaking. I'm extremely new and shaking, actually. On a regular basis. I usually do this thing called spinning, where it's uh, <laughs> spinning is not nearly as effective. Max, I saw you with that shake weight. You should be a lot better than that. Sean, the aftermath. He took up drinking as his favorite hobby. After not getting the girl, he repeatedly wanked it. <laughs> <laughs> he got carpal tunnel syndrome of the third kind. <laughs> the end. <laughs> Ooh.